Hello everyone and welcome back to uh, Red Reaper. Alright, um, it's been a little while since I last recorded, so let's see if I can remember where we gotta go now. I believe I have stumbled into a cutscene. Hey, what's go- what's wrong? I don't feel so good. <laughs> oh! Hey, keep it together. We're almost there. Seems he took yet another spill. Can't seem to catch a break, huh? Don't worry, young soul. You'll be back on your feet in no time. Don't you, um... Don't you leave just yet. The story isn't over. Just a change of perspective. Be right back. Gonna step out for a little bit. I'll be back before you know it. This is all my fault. I shouldn't have put you through this. Wait, do we play as her now? What happened to him? I don't know. We were just walking and he just... Ah, I can't... I can't do this. I can't keep dragging you with me. Don't blame yourself. Mount Vulcan is a hostile environment. It's a wonder you both lasted for as long as you did. Is he gonna be okay? You've not got a heat stroke. It, it's best if you uh, let him rest. I gave the kid a strong sedate, um, sedative. <laughs> Wouldn't want him waking up while he's still recovering. If you know Game Dog, if I know Game Dog well, he'll probably immediately go chasing after you. Wouldn't want that now, do we? So what are you gonna do now? I have a Reaper to fetch. So you're gonna leave him, me here with him? Yes, I can't bring the Pipsquick with me. But what? He killed Eris. You don't think Game Dog would, you know? And well, Valentina, I'm more scared of her actually. If you're so scared, just lock this shop to all visitors. If you're scared of Valentina, she won't be able to get in. As for him, are you seriously implying you can't handle a kid, Aquilus? Uh, of course I can. Fine. I'll lock the shop until you get back. Oh man, my business is going to tank. You're welcome to leave the shop open, only for anyone to enter, even Valentina. Okay, okay, I get it. I'll lock the damn shop. Now get out of here. So I guess we're going to play as Narcissa for a bit. Please hurry. I gotta keep going. I have to find Ixion. With or without Game Dog. Okay, I'm a little worried, honestly, because I don't typically use her for her attacks. Um, oh, if I knew this was going to happen, I would have unequipped myself and maybe gave some stuff to her. Nah, eh, whatever. Anything up here? No. Can I go down? No. I just lost a lot of health for no reason. Oh, never mind, I can get it back. And another one of these places. Alright. I know Aqualus told us not to shop here, but whatever. <laughs> I think this is all the same stuff. I have a cool pin on her, right? Yeah, I do. Are you an enemy or can I talk to you? Do you know how I can get inside? Piss off, lady. Damn, it has to be someone here who can help me. Do you know how I can get inside? No idea. Alright, so she's saying to just talk to more people. Out of the way. Do you have a ticket? No. Then beat it. Do you know how I can get inside? Are you looking for tickets too? Tickets for what? The big HCW event. Hello? It's like you're not even from here. Hades Championship Wrestling, you goof. Hades? Yeah, it's a tournament of salvation tonight. It's a, it's um, it's a huge event. Seriously, you don't know? You must be new here. Yeah, okay, you know what? Look, I'm actually here to see Ixion. You know where I can find him? Is he in that building over there? Yeah, well, everyone's there, actually. Okay, okay, yes, he's in there. But, um, I don't think you'll be allowed to even be near him. Of course.
course. Why the hell not? I'm just like him. I'm a reaper. Yeah, ladies, it's, beca it's because you're a reaper. Ixion has this new no-contact policy in place. Only two people are allowed to be directly in contact with him, one of them being his ward, Pan, and the other, the number one contender. Oh, we... Okay, okay, so it looks like we have, like, a Blitzville kind of uh, situation here. <laughs> the champion being Ixion himself. But I'm sure if, you, if uh, you time it right, you can see him after the show. However, he never leaves the building. So I have to be inside the arena. And you ain't getting inside the arena without a ticket. Where do I get one? I'll buy it from you. I have money. I wouldn't be hanging around the arena if I wasn't looking for a ticket myself. However, I think I know a way you can get in. See the soul guard in the door? Her name is Fran. I think she's all that. Just because she's one of uh, the only female souls to ever make it here. See, if you can bribe her... Um, or, wait, if you can bribe her or do her a favor in exchange for letting you into the arena. Got it. Bribe the gatekeeper. Thanks. Don't thank me. You can get into the arena, but trust me, you're not going to get what you want. Better turn back now. I have to try. Uh, and I can't leave down that way. You know, the dev told me that, like, every, um... No. Every chapter has, like, a gimmick dungeon... Like, the, the gimmick dungeon of the first chapter was that whole murder mystery section. I'm assuming this arena is going to be the gimmick uh, dungeon of the second chapter. I kind of like that, to be honest. Like, it, it's it's a cool way to make different chapters, like, stand out from one another. Do you have a ticket? No. Say, so you're Fran, right? Yeah? Hey, Fran, my name is Narcissa. I'm a reaper, like your leader, Ixion. I need your help. Don't make me laugh. That crap of brains can barely uh, herd a, s a swarm of rats into a room full of cheese. The hell do you want? I have to get in. The policy is clear, ma'am. No ticket, no entry. That means scram. Why you? What are you gonna do? Bulldoze through me? You think I'm gonna let you do whatever you want just because you're a wo because I'm a woman? But I'm also a shut up. You step away, or I call the entire security force down here to deal with you. Okay. But what? Are you sure there's an anything I can do to possibly buy my way in there? The hell kind of person do you think I am? I'll do anything. Shouldn't have said that. Anything? Yes. Just so you and only you can enter. Huh, okay then. No one's listening. Here's what I want you to do. There's this punk named Duncan. He stole my lucky knife. He has my na um has my name engraved on it and everything. And you want me to get it back for you. Yeah, consider it a favor from the from one independent woman to another. But you're literally asking another person to do it for you. Ah, eh, never mind. So where do I find Duncan? Follow up the path east. He should be somewhere in the nearby settlement. How do I know who he is? He has a limp. He should be walking a little slower than the rest of the lost souls there. Bring me my knife and I'll let you in. Got it? Got it. Find Duncan, the guy with the limp, and get your knife back. Okay. And I was gonna say, yeah, we're probably gonna see some normal enemies now. Still can't run from encounters. Oh, I can one-shot those? Okay. Why forever? That's a nice section of detail that, like, Narcissa doesn't get the option to kill them. Like, um, like the protagonist does. Okay, so I probably have to find- Hello. <laughs> I probably have to find the one person here who's walking slower. I should take out the hostile ones first. These battles seem easy enough, so yeah, I think that's a good idea. All the ones I've seen so far seem to walk normally enough. Now, when the game says the the um, the person who stole the knife is walking slower, I'm assuming that means like in the way that like um, 
Red Reaper, is that you? Please, please, please kill me. I can't. I'm sorry. Not the person who's, like, walking less frequently, but then when someone does walk, they, like, move to the next, uh, to the next, um... Is that you? They, like, move to the next tile slower. Yeah, there, there's a difference in RPG Maker when you, like, set NPCs to walk. It's you. It's you. There's a difference between, like, walking speed and walking frequency. And I'm assuming that's what I need to look for here. And if you notice, that guy right there is walking incredibly slowly by comparison. Rude. <laughs> Are you Duncan? Yeah, what do you want? Are you here to make fun of me? No, I'm here to on behalf of Fran. Don't know who that is. You have something that belongs to her. A knife. She wants it back. No idea what you're talking about. Okay. Here, I have her knife. Give it to me. It isn't yours. No, I can't let you. She'll kill me. Likely story. Give it to me or I'll call or I'll take it. No, please, I have no way of defending myself. She's already killed all my friends. She's a lunatic. She and I aren't even really purged of our sins. We both snuck into Mount Vulcan through a secret tunnel. And then, we, uh, when we emerged, the heat made her completely unhinged. Killed everyone. Evan, Byrne, Yanni, everyone except me. What if I get her to leave you alone? Please, please do. You're a Reaper like Ixion. But I know you're different. Is that because I'm the Red Reaper? No, I sense an honesty about you. Honor, integrity. You're not like Ixion. I feel like I can trust you. Yes, I'll keep this, um, you will keep this promise, yes? Yes, I will. Graham will leave you alone, but first you have to give me the knife. Okay, here. Just please tell her to leave me alone. He went here when he... Huh, okay. Rusty knife engraved on his name, Fran. Okay. And it looks like that's all that's here. Where's my knife? Here it is. Thank you. Now before I um before I let you in, that's all I'm doing. That's all I'm doing for you, Fran. I gave you the knife. Now let me in. Just one more thing. Now that I have my knife back, I can finally get that crippled Duncan. Is he still in that damn settlement? He's not getting away this time. Duncan's not there anymore. He left. I see. Um, I see what's happening here. You're protecting him, aren't you? Yeah. He told me to tell you that you should leave him alone. Seriously? Why are you protecting him? You protect some piece of crap that you don't even know. I'm one of my word, Fran. Sometime you wouldn't know, um, something you wouldn't know about. Huh, fine. That's how we're going to do it, huh? I'll find him myself. And then I'll stab at his stomach until his guts spill out onto the ground. But first I'll do the same to you. Alright. Don't, um, don't do something you'll regret, Fran. Just le let me through. Like hell I'll do that. Um, okay. I'm gonna weaken you. Yeah, that was probably a good idea. Oh! Also, these buffs only last five turns. So it's probably not a great idea to spend all my time buffing, because that'll make it so I'll have to, like, reset these buffs all the time. I resist that, okay. Oh, that's a problem. Uh... Okay, at least you're not gonna spam that over and over again. I do go first as well. I'm gonna use a big swing here. Nice! I was kinda worried I have to heal after that. Stay down. I 
Yep, I'm assuming this is the dungeon of, the, of uh, this area. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. What? Hello? <laughs> Ixion! You. I sensed you. I could feel your presence from miles away. What are you doing in my territory? Hey, Ixion, I... Oh, jeez. God damn it. Get up. The hell is your problem? It's me, Narcissa. What do you want? I need you to come with me. I need all the Reapers to go with me to the Conclave. No. What do you mean, no? I came all the way out here um, to this hellhole just to get you. I don't answer to you. I'm the goddamn Red Reaper! This concerns me. In the whole, uh, in the whole of Hades. That includes you, jackass. Prove me wrong. Prove what? That you are indeed the Red Reaper. That you have the strength to take another life. I see you. You're weak. You're afraid. Your soul, your strength, is being held back. By your sins. If you prove your strength to me, I'll join you on your endeavor. Knock me down and I will concede. I want you at your full strength. Here, drink this. <laughs> oh, whoops. Hold on a second. However, your sins weigh heavy on you. They have made you weak. I will not show my full strength. I will only give you 60% of my power. Now show me what you got, Red Reaper. What's this? What's this dread I'm feeling? I'll kick your ass. Ixion's presence strikes fear in your heart. You are unable to gain TP. That's a gimmick. Um, do I have an item that can get rid of that? I feel like I should use this now. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this just for like a neutral turn and- Oh, you resisted. Alright, um... You go before me. That's good to keep in mind. I'm gonna weaken you. Wait, what? He's not moving. That's a lot of health. Um, huh. That's a bit of attack up and a defense down on his end. I feel like I should guard. That was probably very smart. Um, what happens if I use a throwing knife on you? You resist that too. Okay, now we're doing some damage. Is that all you got?
Oh, I have to weaken you. Okay. I, this is going to be a very long battle if I do have to, like, drain all of his health. About halfway there. Oh, whoops. Uh... Okay, like, I think I get the fight at this point. Okay, I should have meditated first. Oh, and, yeah, and then use the... Wait, what? Pathetic. Oh, okay. <laughs> not like this. You are weak. You have always been weak. But do not worry, friend Narcissa. I will make you strong. So I guess we're inside the arena now. Who is this guy? <laughs> hey, girl, wake up. Where am I? Who are you? Relax, I'm not gonna hurt you. Who are you? What have you done to me? Where is Ixion? My name is Pam. My ring name is Miss Deeds. I'm your locker room, buddy. Oh my god, this really is the glitz pit. <laughs> locker room? Yeah, welcome to the women's locker room. It's just the two of us, I'm afraid, so you better get used to seeing me. There, um, 
There was supposed to be another female con uh, contender in here named Fran, but I think something happened to her. So the Booker's probably got you as a replacement. What is going on here? Um, don't you know? Know what? You're now an entrant in the very famous Tournament of Salvation. A last minute replacement. Talk about a real swerve, huh? What? Tournament? I don't have time for this crap. I gotta get out of here. Wait. What? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Why not? You're a participant in the tournament. That means you're bound by blood to, uh, to, to the Arena of Salvation itself. If you leave the building, you'll die. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just... I've had a rough day. I'm Narcissa. Pleased to meet you, Pam. That's a scary ring name. I like it. Ring name? Oh, that's not your ring name. Oops, sorry, I meant what a lovely name for such a lovely, uh... It's okay. What am I gonna do now? I'm stuck in here. That's not all bad, um... It's not all that bad, love. There's a big crowd out there. Bigger than usual, I hear. It's the perfect chance for us to really show our stuff. Well, at least for a while, anyway. Female contestants don't usually last past the first round, but I'm already in the arena, at least. I better get looking for Ixion. Yeah, if you, uh, if you... If you enter the tournament to fight the undisputed champion Ixion, I have some bad news for you. you. Better curb your expectations. Why? It's it's literally the only reason why I came here. You purged your sins for years just to be able to meet Ixion? Not exactly. Don't worry, we're all chasing that impossible dream. No one ever makes it to salvation, not even the boys. But the chance is always there. Whoever beats the champion at the end of the tournament gets his or her salvation. Oh, is that how things work here? Wow, how long were you asleep? Well, anyway, what, uh, what you're saying is there's a chance I can meet Ixion in that ring. Yeah. I mean, technically you have a chance, it's just the chance is zero. Why zero? Because women, no female contestant ever makes it past the first round. That's just the way of life in, in the in the macho world called... Oh my god. Okay, people have been getting really angry at how I pronounce this word. <laughs> Apparently this is like a location in, like, Greek mythology... I don't know. I, I I look at it. I don't know how you say it. Like it's Thelgathon. That's like the, clo the what? I, that's all I can think of. Like, what if I made it past the first round? I'm listening, and I kept going and going until the very end. Sweetie, you're crazy. I like you. How many asses do I have to kick? It's sudden death. Once you're defeated in a round, it's game over. There are two divisions: Division A and Division B. I believe you're in A. I'm in B. The winners of A and B face each other in the semifinals. The winner of that will have the privilege of being uh, um, of being killed by Exion. Okay. I feel like we're gonna fight each other at the end of this already. I'm sorry. That's uh, that's what always happens, you see. But technically, the last match is a fight to the death. In the absolute impossible scenario that you somehow win, you receive your salvation. Yep, that's the meaning of life. That's what we've all been working for, purging our sins for years on the outside. Clawing our way into Mount Vulcan, and entering a spot, uh, spot on the tournament, only to be killed in the end. But you know what? No more. That's going to change today. When I see you, I see a champion. That, ch uh, that chump Ixion, Ixion's days are numbers. Hell yeah. You know, I, um, I already met him outside the arena. You did? What happened? He beat the crap out of me. Well, in any case, I'm not here to get my salvation. I'm here to fetch Ixion. I need him for something. Oh wow, in that case, I didn't know it was possible, but... Your odds are even worse now. I'll admit, maybe I'm here for more than just Ixion. On my way to the arena, I've seen how you souls live, and I gotta say, I'm horrified. Something's gotta change. I gotta snap Ixion back into reality. His territory is being managed like a damn fight club, for goodness sake. Who are you really? You don't sound like the rest. I'm not from here, Pam. I'm Narcissa, a reaper from Leth. Or Leith, I don't know. You're a what? You're a reaper? You're like him. You're like Ixion. Yes. Maybe you do have a chance after all, and maybe the rest of us do too. I guess the girls have to do all the work around here, huh? L um, let's get you and everyone else here in the um to the afterlife. Your promised salvation. You really do that for us? It's my job. It's our job as reapers. Vixion doesn't do his responsibilities, and it's time an outsider intervenes. Yeah, that sounds like an awesome plan. But first, we gotta get ready. I'm all set, but you, girl, you need a haircut. What are you doing? Don't worry, Narcissa. You know how I know how to cut hair. Don't you dare touch my hair. I mean, none of the other cont uh, contenders are going to fight clean. These long locks of yours are an easy target. Easy to pull um to pull you down. 
Fine. Just be careful, okay? You know, I always find it kind of fun when, like, a major character gets, like, a design change partially through the, the story. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna ask the dev if this was inspired by Glitz Pit after this. <laughs> I've even played Thousand Year Doors and I know what that is. Welcome gentlemen and gentlemen to Hades Championship Wrestling. We are live here in the solo in the sold out arena of salvation. My name is Pan and I'll be your host. Now without further ado, it's t it's now time for the tournament of salvation. Where'd you get that voice clip? We got a monster of a show for you tonight. Now, HCW Universe, are you ready? Just a little bit more. there. Well, what do you think? Oh no, you don't like it? Ooh, I love it. Great, now for our last step, which is, we need to give you a ring name. How about Narcissa? Is that really necessary? Can't it just be Narcissa? You said it sounded menacing or something. No, trust me, you need a real ring name. Something like, um, Dominator or Blood Queen. Something that describes who you are. Yet is incredibly badass. Princess Pain. No, too dainty. Violent Violence. <laughs> Not too forced. When I'm Executioner. Nope, too effective. Misdeeds. There. Oh wait, that's my name. How about Red Reaper? What? Mistress Red Reaper. Um, just the Red Reaper. Yeah, Red Reaper, that's perfect. Let's kick ass, Misdeeds. See you in the semifinals, Red Reaper. Oh my goodness, okay, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> Alright, girlfriend, you have a bit of time until your first Division A match. Quick question, do you know any magic? Yeah, I know a couple of buff spells. Yeah, no, that's not gonna be enough. Here, read the book. Blast. This spell is an offensive energy blast with no specific elemental tributes. Okay, so it's like flare. You can only target one enemy at a time. One more. Do you have a finishing move? Yeah, I call it the big swing. I take my scythe and then... No, no, weapons aren't allowed in the tournament. What? Oh, well, that makes sense. I'll teach you one right now. It's called Choke Slam. You're pretty tall for a girl. You can pull it off, I'm sure. All right. Everything I'm, uh, everything I'm about to say is very important, so listen. HCW wrestling matches aren't your usual fights. There are rules. If you want to know how it works, there is a rule book in the mini library. Uh, probably that on the right. Make sure you read it before you leave. Also, your clothes aren't regulation. And again, weapons aren't allowed. There is a ring attire for you and your locker. Put your weapon there too. Your locker is the one with the blood on it. <laughs> Sorry, it's the only one that wasn't locked. There's also a vending machine if you want drinks or whatever. The stuff is more expensive than usual though. Capitalism, am I right? Also, don't rush into your first match without knowing more about your opponent. You can talk to me or any um, or anyone you see out in the hallway for intel. Oh yeah, good luck. Break a leg, like literally, like your opponent's leg, not your own leg. That would be dumb. Okay then. I think we're gonna leave it off here. Next time we'll start this. This is this sounds like it's gonna be kind of fun. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.